Chances are you know someone who's battled a heart condition. Advocates say that heart disease is the leading killer in our nation, and stroke is also one of the top killers. But one group is channeling their love for those lives touched by heart disease in an active way. 7 News reporter Aliyah Keller joins us now live in the 7 News studio and takes us to a walk and the special cause behind it. Aliyah. Well, Steve, you may have heard of the Ohio Valley Heart Walk. It's a big fundraiser for those lives touched by heart disease and stroke. And advocates believe in the need now more than ever. I just admire those that have survived heart disease and they're an inspiration to all of us. Just like everyone else, Jill Spangler isn't just getting back in shape, but she's fighting to save lives one step at a time. A cause that's close to her heart. As I'm learning more about it, something that not only do I want to um, make a priority for myself, but also for my daughter, um, just to make sure that heart health is part of our life, healthy eating, physical activity. And as over 300 get their steps in, thousands of dollars give back. We have raised over $70,000. Through it, they celebrate heart disease and stroke survivors in the Ohio Valley and all those touched by it. But the need has been especially time sensitive as of lately. Oh, this is huge, um, especially during this pandemic. Um, the individuals that are affected the most by this virus are heart and stroke survivors. Um, so we are doing research um, to uh, help with um, the symptoms of COVID. And beyond COVID, advocates say there's more to this fundraiser. It helps teach CPR, eating healthy and exercising. But at the end of the day, improving the heart health of the community is first and foremost. And advocates say taking this walk is only one way to get behind this special cause. But there's others. You know someone who is affected by this, so that's why it's so important to uh, bring fundraising dollars in because your neighbors, your family members, your coworkers, they're directly affected by this every day. Now, if you'd like to support the lives of those touched by heart disease and stroke, go to the link on your screen and donate. Live in the 7 News studio, Aliyah Keller working for you.